Hi viewers, welcome back again to HVAC Simplified and today's topic of the day will be HVAC Equipment Selection Design Criteria. Today we are going to see what are the essential parameters which is required to select any air conditioning equipment. The design criteria for equipment selection. The first important parameter which is required is an ambient temperature. The ambient temperature can be measured in degree Fahrenheit or degree centigrade. The next important parameter is total capacity. The unit for the total capacity will be to MBH, BTU or kilowatts and it can also be measured in tonnage, tonnage of requirement for any HVAC equipment. The second important parameter is sensible capacity which is also measured in MBH, PTU or kilowatts. Supply air flow which is measured in CFM or liter per second. There are another units also where the air flow is measured but these are the two important widely used units for supply air flow. Fresh air requirement, fresh air flow, which is also measured in CFM and liter per second. This is the fresh air requirement for HVAC equipment, which is also ambient temperature or it can also be pre-treated depending on the design of the system. Entering coil temperature, entering coil temperature also measured in Fahrenheit or degree centigrade. This is the Entering coil temperature is also known as on coil temperature. So this is the temperature which is on the coil. Leaving coil temperature is the temperature where air leaves from the coil. External static pressure is measured in Pascal or inches of water gauge. External static pressure is required to select any equipment for HVAC fans, blowers and sizing the motor. So the external static pressure is usually calculated for the longest route of uh, HVAC duct and the internal static pressure is calculated by the software or any HVAC supplier. The power supply which will be involved phase and hence depending on the project location and requirement. So these are the important and essential parameters for selection any HVAC equipment starting from window AC, mini splits, cassette type units, ceiling mounted, floor standing, air cool condensers, package units, air handling units and chillers. To select any HVAC air conditioning equipment, these are the parameters which are required. So we need to so way to get this parameter. These parameters are derived by heat load calculation for which I will be making another video in detail. So when you perform a heat load calculation for any system, the software will provide you these parameters through which you will be selecting any HVAC equipment. Additional essential requirements for chill water air conditioning equipments. So basically HVAC system is comprised of DX6 system, direct expansion system and chill water system. For any chill water system, these are the important additional essential requirement along with the previous ones which will be entering water temperature, leaving water temperature and chill water flow. So you need to also consider these three important factors by selecting any HVAC water cooled chiller, water cooled air handling units and water cooled chill waters, fan coil units. Thank you very much viewers. Hope you like my video and See you soon in my next videos.